Those voting yes, 81. Those voting no, 63. And you have concurred with the Senate. The decision on the floor of the Vermont House capped a furious debate. I am profoundly disappointed in this body's decision to legalize marijuana. Top law enforcement called the House vote on Bill 511 irresponsible, given the governor's special commission on marijuana has a report coming out in a couple of weeks. We are disappointed in the conduct of our elected officials, they said, as they rushed to legalize marijuana without allowing all of the facts to be fully vetted. Look at the tragedies we've had this past year on the, on the roadways, the fatalities. So, you know, you're basically telling victims that you don't have, you have no concern for what they've gone through by, by legalizing this. The bill would allow Vermonters to grow a plant or two at home and possess up to one ounce of marijuana. No retail shops, no tax windfall for the government. 511 now moves over to the Senate for a final vote next week. It will pass and I think people will find that it leads to a more rational approach to small amounts of marijuana possession and use. Um, and that will pass, my guess is sometime late next week and move on for the governor's signature, which he has said he will, he will sign. Still, it falls short for some who'd prefer strict government testing and regulation, like some Western states. To me, it's a first step. I think, um, as many have remarked, it's inevitable. The question isn't if, it's when. And I don't see how much, uh, what the point would be of not creating a regulated system once you've legalized it. For now, an incremental step, which Governor Scott says he will sign into law. In Montpelier, Stuart Ledbetter, NBC5 News.